So you talked with your partner about the incident report. Did you find mistakes? So we already know one of the mistakes is corrected for us in the book. The name of the child, the child's name, is not Jessica McCain, it's Jessica McClure. So that's the first mistake. What's the second mistake? The incident date is incorrect. It's wrong. It should be October 14th, 1987. Or 10, 14, 1987. What's the third mistake? The location of the incident was not in the playground. It was in the back yard of Reba McClure's sister. Or we can say it was in the backyard of Jessica's, Jessica's what? Aunt. Okay, so we can write that one, the backyard of Jessica's aunt, or the backyard of Reba McClure's sister. Is the equipment correct? It says well. Is that correct? Yes. Yes. The cause of injury, is that correct? No. Yes, Jessica was walking in the yard and she fell in the well. Did Jessica push the rock? No. She was just walking around in the yard. Someone else, bigger than Jessica, pushed or rolled the rock away. And she was just walking around and then the whole, boom, she fell inside of it. Is the height of the fall correct? No. No, it wasn't six feet. It was 20 feet. All right, what about the parts of the body injured? Did she have some part of her face injured? Okay. Did she have her arm or wrist or hand injured? No. What part of the body did they, t did they talk about? Leg, ankle, foot, that part. So that was another one. How about the action taken? Is that correct or not? Not correct. That's correct. They rescued her from the well. They rescued her from the well. That's correct. And then Jessica went to the hospital. That's correct. So don't change those sentences. Those sentences are good. All right. Now, I would like to introduce you to the language focuses.